As part of a study process, it's important to be able to make notes, ask and answer questions, clip key pieces of information and organise your research. This video will look at how you can do all three from within Logos itself. Notes are used to make comments and add links to resources. Open the Tools menu and click Notes. This shows all your current notes and highlights in a faceted browser. Use the facets on the left to focus in on particular notes you want to look at. To clear the facets and show all the notes again, click All. Notes can be stored in notebooks and we're going to use one for this video series. Click the Notebooks icon, then click the plus sign and enter the name of the notebook. In this case, Notes on John 7, 37-39. Click the notebook to open it. Then, to add a note, click the drop-down to the right of New Note and choose from the various options. In this case, select New Note on John 7, 37-39. This will automatically be placed in the open notebook. Give the note a title by entering thoughts on the passage at the top and start typing. Some things we might want to explore in this passage are What are some of the key Old Testament references relevant to this passage? How else is the word translated believes in verse 38 translated elsewhere in the New Testament? What is the sense of the word believes in verse 38. How do different translations treat the word drink in verse 37? And we'll come back to these questions in later videos. Clipping documents are used to hold extracts from resources that you think will be important in your study. To create one, click Docs and then Clippings. Call this file Clippings Related to John 7, 37-39. Then, to populate it, select a portion of text from the dictionary article we looked at in the previous video. Right-click to open the context menu. Ensure that the selection box at the top right is selected and click Add to Clippings. This will add it to the Clippings document. Click the resource identified at the top left of the clipping to open the resource to the clipped article. Again. We'll use this clippings file in later videos. To organise your research, you can use favourites. These are available in the Tools menu, and it's worth creating a folder structure that makes sense to you. We're going to create a folder called Bible Study Stroke Sermon Prep, although if you already have one of this name, there's no need to do so again. Click the New Folder button at the top of the panel and type the new name into the folder then drag it to the position you want. To create a subfolder called John 7 37 to 39, click New Folder, give it a name, and then drag it over the top level folder you created earlier. Now you can simply drag Logos items to the folder, such as the Notes Notebook and the Clippings Document, and easily find results of your research on this passage when you need it later. The combination of notes, clippings and favourites provides a very powerful way of performing and consolidating your research within the Logos environment. The next video will focus on the powerful search features in Logos that provide the ability to perform simple or complex searches across your whole library or a subset of it in seconds.